What's up guys, uh, whiskey review time. Another new bottle. I know you're getting used to me opening new bottles each time. Um, I can tell you right now, I cannot afford to keep that up. But while the streak is hot, let's keep rolling with it. New bottle here, uh, it's pronounced, if you can see that there, it's pronounced a knock. It's not how I would have said it, but that's how they want me to say it. That's how I'm gonna say it. Uh, Midweek, so I'm gonna measure this one out. Fresh bottle. Um, whew, look at that color, nice and yellow, uh, amber, golden almost. Ooh, geez. I love that sound, absolutely gets me going. Uh, guys, this is a Highland whiskey. Now, with a Highland whiskey, my problem sometimes with it is that uh, sometimes it can add a little bit of peat. Now, peat's not my favorite, like, peat is smoke. Um, I'm okay with it, but I, I don't prefer it though. So this is a knock, this is the 12 year uh, Highland single malt. Yeah, it actually says on there it's got a smoky taste, so that, that worries me. Uh, but we're gonna roll with it, I'm gonna give it a review and, and see how it goes. Hats on, of course. Guys, I love this time in Australia, it's, uh, it's cricket season. The Big Bash started last night, so cricket basically is on TV every night of the week. Give us a whirl around. Ooh, legs. Legs, you can, I don't think you can see it, but the legs are like, when you swirl it around, it drips down. And if it's really thick and slow, it means it's quite oily. And I like an oily, buttery, you know, I like the word butter, uh, flavor or the feeling, texture in the mouth. This is reasonably thick legs, so I'm ima imagining it's gonna be quite oily. So there we go. Oof. So instantly I'm not smelling any smoke, which, I'm excited about. Uh, color, like we said, amberish. It's almost like a beer. It's like a nice pale ale, which is good. We'll give it a go. Whew. Okay. Happy to announce, I can't pick up any peat, no smoke. So, I want this label changed. It's very complex though, it's very, I find Speyside is like super easy to drink. And Highlands, yeah, because of that, sometimes I got that peat, that smoke factor, like sometimes it's a little bit more complex. And this is very complex, there's like honeysuckle, definitely honey, like, I said honeysuckle, I don't even know what that is. Honey, honey suckle sounds nicer. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. So, there's no no real burnish. It's a long finish though, or medium to long. Still in my mouth. Like I'm talking to you, but I can still taste this whiskey. Slowly creeping down the mouth. A little bit oily, which is nice. Ooh, hello. What's that? You are complex. That's a little like a uh, passion fruit. I think I'm getting a little passion fruit. It's, it's, I don't know how to describe what complex tastes like, but when you taste it, you know it. And this is complex. This is honey. I'm getting a little bit of, um, ooh, how do I describe it? Like oat, barley, and passion fruit. One more, one more. Mm hmm Yeah, it's light, it's easy to drink. It's light but complex, which is a bit of a weird one, but it definitely is complex, but it's definitely easy drinking. It doesn't taste thick or it doesn't taste like, like a meal. It's just it's in your face with honey. With late, 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 very late, probably three sips in, that's two, but probably three sips in, passion fruit. <sighs> still a, a very medium to long finish, like I'm still tasting this, which I enjoy. So, I definitely would recommend this, the Anok. The only problem I've got with it, it says, it says complex, so I picked that up. Smoky taste, it's not very really smoky at all. If you're someone that doesn't enjoy peat or smoke, this whiskey is definitely fair game for you. The score on this one, one more, 
finish off there. Seven six, seven point six, good score. Scoring system for me, if it's above five, it's drinkable. Below five, it's like ugh, forget about it. Once you get up, uh, above a seven or a seven point five, three quarters of the way up, you're looking at a, a fairly pretty solid whiskey. This is a seven six. This is a little bit better than that. This is a really good whiskey, easy to drink. Thoroughly recommend it if you're new to whiskey. It's actually, you know what, I, you know what it is. It's not the bottle. It's like a, it's a good, complex, like next level up whiskey. Like once you've had this really smooth, really light ones, easy to drink. This is like a good step up. Good entry level Highland whiskey for me, but definitely a good little step up. Something a little bit more complex, a little more something, something to it. Get your hands on it. Whiskey review done.